Hi everyone, it's Lily Bell from Melbourne, Australia. I hope you're all well. Firstly, I really apologise by the way I look. Um, yeah, I wasn't going to be doing a video until the new year and I felt obviously more up to it. But uh, earlier this morning, it is the 28th of 28th of December 2019 at midday in Melbourne, Australia. It came to my attention through sheer luck. Um, I was unable to sleep and I turned off my audio audio thing on YouTube because it sometimes gets... <laughs> I will be watching or listening to a live, a pre-recorded live from one someone that um, I support but was unable to catch a live and wake up so that I'm in a room that I no longer want to be in. And um, I thought I'd turned it off. Um, ow. <laughs> um, but I'm kind of glad... Uh, it worked because I woke up to being in uh, Mummy Rambling's blog. It was pre-recorded um, with Carolyn and it was discussing the health of, of someone that's always supported me who's just a top guy. Uh, and you'll see in comments on my channel how supportive he's been of me. Um, random guy Jeff uh, is very, very unwell. And I don't want to say too much because I don't know much. Um, but Carolyn from Mummy's Ramblings blog, because he's part of the Ramblers, um, but he's got many friends that have left that community and obviously have many friends from different communities. Uh, I wanted to let people know that are in my uh, owls group in case they didn't know that he's very unwell um, and he needs prayers. If you want to know more, there is a... Uh, about a 30 minute video of Carolyn uh, Mummy Rambling blog talking about it. She'd spoken to him briefly from the hospital, I think that morning, that night, whatever, today, whatever, I get confused with the times. Um, it doesn't sound great. Um, so I want to, like, I'm in shock to be honest. Um, I had been dealing with my own stuff and I feel a little selfish that I didn't even think or notice that I hadn't spoken to him for a little bit um, because the last I heard he was going in to get, get one of his front teeth pulled and he was worried about it, um, how long he was going to have to go without a front tooth, <laughs> which is kind of funny. So if you are religious at all, please can you pray for him and those his loved ones. There's also many in the actual Ramblers community from watching that video that are suffering and um, many have got a lot of health issues that aren't well at all. Um, and I do realise that some of us, like myself, um, are now not a part of that community. But we are all human beings and a lot of these people, uh, you know, even though if they've heard us or not, they're still human. Um, many of them were still once people we spoke about or spoke to and aren't well at all. And so I want to offer my prayers to anyone in the Ramblers or in the YouTube community, whether you're a creator or someone that just watches and and um, contributes that way, 
um, and loved ones, anyone that's very unwell, that's sick, that's dying, or has lost a loved one or found a loved one that's sick or is just going through heartache, to please um, extend your your prayers. And if you don't pray, then do whatever it is you do when someone that you care about send out positive vibes or whatever um, because in the end life is short. Uh, we are human beings and just because we may not be friends or we may not like someone doesn't mean we want to wish them any harm and I'm not talking about random guy Jeff. He is a friend and he's been very, very loyal to me um, and supportive. I'm just talking about others that are hurt, that are suffering. I don't know to what extent, but it sounds a lot of suffering at the moment. And um, especially this time of year, it really, really sucks. So that's why I've come on swollen and all pretty. <laughs> um, yeah, because I think I wanted you guys to know I wanted everyone to um, do what they can do um, for a random guy, Jeff, and also the, anyone else that is suffering. And um, just really think about what's important in life and that, you know, it's okay to be hurt with someone that's hurt you oh sorry guys got allergies because of the smoke here and the fires um yeah what was i saying um oh look just basically we're human beings and we don't have to like or be friends with someone to actually show compassion and support and i I did write in under the video my support for Random Guy Jeff, whether it's received or not, uh, it doesn't matter. I, I've done the right thing, I, I believe. And I've asked for someone in the community to let me know what's going on. I don't know if that's going to happen, uh, but I will... Go and keep tabs if I have to, um, in a in a respectful way that I don't cause con any more conflict. Um, because in the end, it's about random guy Jeff, um, and I know he'd want me to know. And those of you that know of him, or even just uh, um, want to support a fellow human being that's uh, really struggling right now and is not in a good way. So if you want to know more, I will just go over and there is um, a video and it is Carolyn explaining a little bit more um, when I can find out more information. I will let you guys know if you want to wait. But um, please remember that uh, I am struggling with, with this. Um, but I just thought it was very important to come on to let you guys know. Um, and so just um, I think it's really important. The message that I keep trying to spread is um, to love and respect yourself and others. And remember that if you're having a bad day, that there is always tomorrow. And um, try not to spread any hate or ill will towards another person, even if they've hurt you, because life is short. And I would assume and I would hope that anyone that I'm associated with would never wish anything ill will towards a soul another human being, all an animal, because that's the way I am and that's the kind of people that I want to associate with. 
Um, so please do what you do. Um, pray, send out positive vibes, whatever it is, to random guy Jeff and his family and loved ones and to anyone else and there's many out there that are suffering um okay guys uh i want to say merry christmas and i hope you have a happy new year's eve and be safe uh, i don't know if it's, if it's a appropriate at the end of what i've just said but it's a life goes on as well um maybe it is more appropriate than ever and um if you're suffering, remember that I've got your back and I'm thinking of you and um, I miss you all and I need to stop talking. <laughs> okay, I want to do a special shout out to uh, Black Rose. Most of you probably have heard of her. She's one of my good friends. Um, also to Aussie Broad. Um, I've been unable to talk to, um, you guys and you've been such support to me and, um, <clears throat> there's a few others as well, but, um, hopefully you know who you are, but definitely those two, uh, I love you lots and, uh, remember again to, uh, just to think that and remind yourself that life is short and to make every day and every moment count as much as you can. All right, guys, I'm going to get going and it's, uh, even though it's lunchtime, I'm going back to sleep. <laughs> um, okay, guys, God bless you all and I'm sorry to come to you with this news, but I thought that um, it's only right for you guys to know in case you're like me and you had no idea. And so, um, yeah, okay. Um, God bless you, random guy Jeff. And um, my thoughts are with you and your loved ones, especially tomorrow when if your blood count, uh, what is it? He's lost a lot of blood, so... He needs to have surgery tomorrow, um, but only if his blood count is high enough to not be at risk. So um, I will keep you guys informed, um, even though I shouldn't be on. I think it's important. Um, please all be kind. Um, I know you will be. You're all beautiful people. And, um, yeah, take care, guys. Love you from Melbourne, Australia. Lily Bell.